A very good evening to you. We are launching a brand new one day special as we do every night here on Hochanda and I've got a feeling it's going to be a busy one. We've got the lovely John Lockwood, the boy next door, <laughs> who is next door to Hello. me. Hello. Through his screen. Yeah, I we said are... to Hayley the other day, I feel like I, should, I do have to put ten pence in halfway through the show. <laughs> Stop the shutter coming Actually, down. Actually, yes, it's more like uh, ten pounds. Ah. <laughs> Just leave it down there. Uh, it's great to have you company, John. You know I love doing shows with you. You're very informative. You know you your stuff when it comes to craft you're a crafty yourself I, I try to I'm, I'm a crafter so I may not know the technical terms <laughs> and the right ways to do it but I always sort of bodge it my way and if I can share that with people then I love to oh, do it. Oh that's fantastic now what are we looking forward to in the show today John? Well what I wanted to do is we wanted to put together a bundle I love this out of the box crafting yes so I like the idea that you get when you get your package at home you open it up and you go right yeah I can do something straight away you're not Oh, why didn't I order this? And I needed that. Yeah. So I with this bundle I've put together, I think I love the flower foam. The yeah. flower foam is amazing stuff. It really is. And I wanted to give people the library. This is my library. This is mine from home. Okay. This is literally how I store yeah. mine. And the idea was I wanted to give people that to have all the different options and colours. But to have that, then of course you needed to have all the stamens to match. Yes, you do. But then, of course, it's no use without dies. It's not, and so that's why... We threw three die sets in as well. I think this is an incredible deal, it really is. Maybe you've not experimented making and creating your own flowers before. This is going to be the perfect opportunity for you to do so. It's at a great price as well, and we're dividing the cost into two interest-free payments as well, which always helps leading up to Christmas, doesn't it? Freedom members, no PMP to pay for you guys. If you want to become a Freedom member, you can do today, and it means you won't be paying any PMP just head to the website so let's talk about the 60 foam sheets that you are getting a beautiful array of colors now when you first see these they look like card or paper but it's not it's foam that you can manipulate you can stretch so that you can create realistic lifelike petals it is yeah the difference is and I've given you a sheet as well so yes. the flower you've got in your hand yes that is done just through digital manipulation Ooh, I like and that by saying that i mean with your fingers and your hands oh your digits in your fingers digits in your hands so like it's digital that. okay so you don't need any you don't need a computer a laptop a pad or anything perfect you don't need an iron a heat gun or anything no. so no this is all done literally just with your hands oh let's have so a go if you actually see my to the foam i've got a sheet here of the red okay. yeah watch all i do pull Pull. Oh my word. Pull. That's it. Oh, I've torn it. Well, petals are torn. Pull. Pull. So you do the same. No heat needed. Nothing. This that is the is finest amazing. foam you can get. This you can is see amazing. there, that's it. Straight away. And all I've done is literally just pull my two my fingers apart. Hold it there like that and pull. Do you know what? Do you know what it feels like? It feels like I shouldn't really say, you know, chewing gum. <laughs> Yeah. You know, it, it feels like that. Look at this, so easy to manipulate. It's the first time I've picked it up and I'm just pulling that apart just gently. It doesn't matter if you rip that because like John says, flowers can be torn, they can be ripped, you can make them look lifelike and realistic. You get 50 sheets of these, 60 sheets of these, my word. Right. 10% of the stock already gone, but it's not just about the sheets of foam, no. You are also getting 96 of the stamens. Now, let me just take this very carefully from behind and show you these. Now, these are absolutely gorgeous. I've got them in bunches. You get eight packs and you get 12 per pack. These are beautiful, John. These are gorgeous. These were designed to go with the flower foam, so the colours work. But each one of these, when you look at a bunch, it's not a bunch with one head on it. No. Nope. Each head that's in there has at least six, sometimes 12, heads inside it. Some of them are glass, some have got little glass beads on it, then some of them got bobbles on. Every single one is different. Every one is individual. So you can see, I mean, I've got one here. It's just got so many different pieces in it. But I, when I split one of those bundles, that is what you're getting inside. And you've got eight of those. So you've wow. got 12 inside. So you've got those. So that's 12 from one bundle. But you can see all the individual pieces that you're getting. 
And it's it's luxurious, isn't they it? They are. It they is are quality. absolutely luxurious and quality. But we're not stopping there because you have got more. You've got three die sets included in this deal. Like John says, it's an out of the box experience. It could be a brand new craft directly out of that box. Let's talk about those dies and the system that we use with the dies. So you've got your elderflower die set, which is beautiful, your peony die cut sheet, and the fold rose die set as well, which is really easy to use, isn't it? John? They are all really, really simple to use. So the, di the pl di peony die plate, you literally, you just cut that yep. and it's been designed. So you will get that cut four times from each individual sheet of foam. Wow. Then you've got the rolled rows, and again, they will work, so you get both of those four times out. And then you've got the, I've actually put, I've, I'm sorry, I have two sets of a lot of my <laughs> flowers. I'm very naughty, I buy a second set. Then you've got all the elderflower, but if I bring this sample in by being really naughty, yep. you can see here, this is one I made during one episode of QI. Wow. So this was less than this was this was half an hour and this is using the elderflower, the peony plate and just three of those stamens what? and this is using less than I think this uses half a sheet of the foam. No, really? Yep, that's literally it. Take now that would make off. a beautiful centrepiece for Christmas because it's almost like a poinsettia as well. It is. And yeah. the beauty of using these dyes, yes you can make those Oops. gorgeous flowers well done. but with but you the foam. But you the 3D. Yeah. It's beautiful. There's no ugly part of it, but that, the cost of that is hardly anything. That's amazing. It really is. It's amazing. When you think about how much faux flowers cost when you go around to the uh, stores and shops, even when you go to, um, you know, some of the stores that you think, oh, that's going to be cost effective. You go in, you start picking up and collecting those faux flowers, and my word, that price tag does add up. Now, we are approaching a quarter of the stock, a quarter of the stock already, seven minutes into the show. Uh, once this has gone, it has gone. We do have Wild Stock's last bundles, but while this particular bundle that you've got together right now, a quarter of the stock has gone. The rose on here is gorgeous, and roses are beautiful, and something that you can use all year round, and for all different occasions as well, John. They are, yeah, you can use them all the time, and again, you can use that in any way you want to. So that one, I've got to say thank you to Janet Darrell, that's actually a piece that she she made me for my home. Oh, really? Um, yes, that wasn't made as a sample, but here we've got one, again, just made up using the cream, I think it's the clotted cream that comes in one of the packs. Oh, how gorgeous. You've got, like, little rosebuds on there, but the leaves are actually cut from the foam as well, using the green foam. Oh, they really? Now, with the foam, of course, if we're making green leaves, we'll use green foam, but can we add colour? You can, and this is the main thing. A lot of people will say that they prefer they like white foam and to colour it. OK. But I'm going to grab another sample here. This one was made by Sam. Oh, how lovely. So this was made by Sam the other day. This is the first time he has ever used flower foam. No. Yeah. And literally, if anyone knows Sam, they know that he does not take direction from me very well. <laughs> or anyone, to be fair, as Molly has just reminded <laughs> me. Um, so I showed him one flower and that was it. But this, can you imagine... How long would it take you to colour white foam this yellow? Oh, my word, that would take and ages. And then what he's done is he's actually used the eye zinc sprays to make half of the flowers orange by spraying over the top. That is absolutely stunning. But it would stunning. take you about two hours to turn white foam this yellow, then another 20 minutes to turn half of it a darker orange. That was white foam to begin with? No, that's what I mean. Why would you take white foam that's right and spend hours doing it flowers are colored yes so to me if i want a red flower i'll use red foam yeah why would i take white foam and make it red well you're wasting your craft you're wasting um, your, your, your equipment yeah. yeah you don't want to do that we're approaching 40 percent of the stock gone i've got a nice little alice band here shall i pop it on there um that might look nice as well for someone you know look at that that pretty uh, you do need to check out your baskets because when we have items kept in your baskets it means after 10 minutes if they pop out someone else will get them or we don't want that to happen what a fantastic deal this could be a brand new craft for you and I'm thinking well you might want to make create and sell you've got enough time now before Christmas to make up those gift items yep. to then sell them if you want to 40% of the stock has gone over 40% of the stock has gone oh my goodness uh, you're saving 30 
£31 on this deal. Take advantage of Flexi Buy as well. If you're getting anything else in the show, we've got some great items. You might want to add those to your basket so you can split the cost of those into two as well. Right, let's move on, John, because we've got plenty more on the show for you. Now, I absolutely adore your stamp and die bundles, John. I just think this is incredible. And we're going to tell everyone at home exactly how these work together because I think this is ingenious. And this is something that you introduced to the crafting market. It is. It's, it's a system that I invented or came up with because I found it very difficult. So the idea is you've got one stamp. And one stamp will stamp you all the parts of the flower that you need. If I move that along a little bit. So this is the orchid. Okay. Yeah. So this will stamp you one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine pieces. Yeah? Yep. So that's your stamp. Then you have your die. And if you notice, it's got these black corners. Then you have your die. And your die has the corners missing. Let me bring this a little bit more into the middle for you. There you go. Bring it in the right place. So all you do is you stamp that. Yep. You then take the die and you lay the die over the top and you cut it out. Look at that. Precisely and you will have as well. all nine pieces you need to make you three different sizes of orchid or all the pieces of the hydrangea or all the pieces of the camellia wow. in one pass from one piece of A6 card. So it's going to save you time. You're going to get everything you need just by stamping once and cutting once. Yep. Which, of course, if you've got an electronic die cutting machine, that surely is going to save you a little bit of electricity because you're only putting through the die yep. one time. And what it's going to do as well is it's going to save you money on your card. Yep. Because if these were individual stamps, yes. there would need to be space all the way around them. Of course they would. And when stamps are actually put, when stamps are on a stamp plate, so when we're actually designing stamps, yep. you have to leave seven millimetre gap around every stamp design. Do you? Yes. It's part of the instructions of making photopolymer stamps oh. in the UK. So you have to take a little block, seven millimetres, and you have to run it all the way around. And basically, so that couldn't go there. So that would have to be over here. Yes. So if I made these as individual stamps, number one, it would be a lot harder. Yes. But number two, this would actually be an A5 set, which would be double the price nearly. Exactly. Because an A5 set is £15. It makes sense, doesn't it? It's a superb deal. You're making a saving. Freedom members, you're saving £17 and 69 pence. It's a why not deal, which means if you're not a Freedom member, become a Freedom member and make that saving. Your Flexi Freedom as a Freedom member, it's only £21 and 13 pence today. And that gets you the whole set. So you've got your camellia there, your orchid, and your hydrangea as well. Hydrangeas are gorgeous. And I've seen some beautiful samples of the hydrangea when we've done shows before, John, together, where we've had 3D style hydrangeas and they've been absolutely incredible. They have incredible. been gorgeous. Um, I have, and, um, sorry, Leslie did a beautiful three-tiered cake all with the hydrangeas. Yeah, it's but I've got so many samples to bring, I couldn't... I just couldn't get them any more in the car, unfortunately. Uh, just to show you some samples of what they look like when they're stamped out. This one, is this the... Sorry, that's the rolled rose. That's the from rolled the first rose. one. I thought so. This one is the one that John has just showed you, uh, which is beautiful, which is the orchid. Of course, you can have the orchid any colour you like. 10% of the stock has gone already. And uh, this one is the camellia. Uh, which is beautiful and then you have your hydrangea so again you can color that and you can have your colors anything you like you can make fantasy star you flowers you can make as fantasy well. flowers yeah. with them you can make anything and all three of those these work perfectly that's with the foam isn't that beautiful so that's the orchid with the foam can you stamp onto the foam so you can you have to use stays on okay perfect so you would have to use black stays on or if you saw the show earlier with Paola, yes. she was showing you some coloured stays on. Yeah, if you did miss that show, it will be available on Rewind. Um, orchids are very, very expensive to buy. Why don't you make your own? And they last forever, don't they, John? Yeah, because if you're yeah. like me, I buy them, they look beautiful, and then three weeks later, the flowers die and it never reflowers. Yeah, you don't want that. No, and I have to send all the orchids I've bought to my friend Mrs Duck. 
Really? And she revives them oh, because goodness. I kill them. So literally, <laughs> she, has a, she, has a, she has a hospital for orchids, whereas now I don't have to because I've got beautiful ones that we've made. Yeah, you can make them yourself. Uh, right, 460-134 is your item number. You're saving £13 on that deal. And um, remember, if you're a Freedom member, it's a why not deal, which means you're making a great seven seventeen pounds and 69 pence as a Freedom member. Now, let's talk about boxes to put presents in. Uh, boxes to have maybe on your bedside table to put something special in to keep it's not just about valentine's day hearts are gorgeous to give out at any time of the year you make it a 17 pound saving and you get 12 dies in total and you get to make well a whole variety of different styled boxes don't well, you, you can the heart box itself will but die set will make you a beautiful heart box as you've got there yes but the sides will actually be make you, with your nesting dies, any shape of box you want. Oh, really? So this hexagon box here that I've got, so you see there, that is made using the sides of the heart box die. Oh, so see. they are designed so that they will work with any nesting shape to make you any shape of box you want. Here's a circle one I made using exactly the same. So instead of using the heart, yes. I use the same sides. You can see there the lines. So I can make any shape of box I want as long as I've got the nesting die for the top. And the reason is that you can't see it in here, but it's got the little, it's the way it's designed. But when I get to demo it, I'll show you how we can go around any shape. Perfect. So this is what the dies look like. And this is what John was just showing you there. So those little lips were at the base and John will show you how to put these together. But of course, as John said, you can make these into any shaped box. But what you've got at the top here are the love hearts to make the lid for the love heart style um, dies. You've also got some beautiful ornate dies that are going to create and build up the layers on the top. And these are interchangeable as well, aren't they, John? They are. Every heart, there are three die sets in this bundle. So across it, there are all the different styles, all the different hearts, but they're all on the same aspect ratio and none of them are repeated. Right. So every single one will interchange with every other to make cards, boxes, anything that you want to. I think um, that's a... The edges will work. There's two, there's two layers of stitch dot, there's two layers of everything. Mm. So you've got so many dies in here. And of course, but this, the heart box die sold out. It did. Sold out with me and you last year. Yes, it year. certainly did. It was very, very busy. Very, and very busy. what's actually happened is, um, people know we've been doing the warehouse clearance shows every month. Yep. Because we've been doing a lot of work in the Crafts 2 warehouse clearing. And as we've been clearing, we've been finding boxes of things we thought we'd sold out of. Well, I'm so glad you found So we found another box I'm of the heart so box glad dies. When you it's did. gone, it's gone. When it's gone, it's gone, everyone. Uh, it's a great buy, £34.97, pence, saving £17. Of course, you can use the heart dies for other projects as well, uh, not just the lids for your boxes. You can also use them for cards as well, for cutting out those beautiful shapes. Right, we've got more for you on the show. We have so much. You can head to the website and get ahead of yourself if you want to and have a look at all the different uh, accessories that we've got on the show as well. We will talk you through some fantastic ones as we go through the demonstrations. Right, more dies for you. Um, £26.97, pence, saving £8. You've got 12 dies in total. This is your Honesty Flowers die collection. Honestly, John, Honestly. this is a fabulous collection. Um, I'm going to show, let me show you the boards and I'll show you samples. Um, so, in your die sets, I shall show you the dies and John can talk you through which ones they are. Let me just yeah, turn it Yeah, you're better looking way. at the dies of these because I got the packaging wrong. Okay. The images on the packaging are right, but they don't represent it properly. Okay. So here you've got, I mean, it's like a faux quilled um, foliage. Yes. So the leaves on each one are based on sort of an almost a heart shape, but the honesty sort of look, which is like the moon flower. Yeah. Um, so each one on there, you've got a left and a right, but it cuts out into, so it gives you almost like, um, I can't think of the like right a word. Like a skeleton? Like a skeleton yep. sort of Let look to it. Let me pick this one up and show you what we mean. But the same with the mean. flowers. So you get that beautiful skeleton leaf, the heart's might dropping. might be that way up. Yeah. Then you've got the matching flowers as well. Yes. Which are the, um, the honesty flowers. And again, you've got all the different sizes in there which will cut out. So you've got two of each size, so you can layer them up really simply. They look absolutely And then you've got beautiful. the Honesty Flourish, which is just one of my favourites. It's a real 
it looks beautiful with with um, the foam flowers, which yeah. is one of the reasons we put it on the show. Oh, yeah, that would look nice. Because it's got that real fullness that you need to get with something behind there. I think they also look nice on um, a decorative piece as well, yes. like corner pieces, for example, because it's so beautiful. Now, if you do want to get hold of this set, twenty-six ninety-seven, great price. Remember, you can add this to your basket. If you've opened a flexi buy, then you can divide the cost into two if you want to. Nine nine eight four zero eight is your item number. Maybe there's something brand new to you. Maybe you've seen this before and you've always wanted to get hold of it. Now's the time to do so 26.97 right the website is where you can head to to see all of the items we've got available for you on the show now we did have the foam individually in sets and we did have the stamens individually but it looks like we sold out of them all <laughs> individually so well done uh, so the best way to get hold of your uh, foam sheets and the stamens is in the one day special we do have a while stocks last when we sell out of the one day special we have that anticipation uh, but the only way to get the full package that we have right here right now is by getting the one day special we've got mica magics as well look at the five star reviews we've got your finger daubers for you we've got your ink petals we've got a stamp cleaner as well which normally we sell out of every time we bring it to you so we will have a look at that it's only 9.99 it's an incredible price and if anything if you're thinking about a stocking filler a secret santa or a gift for a crafter for the crafter that has everything i bet you they've not got one of these this is going to be the perfect gift it's only 9.99 and john will show you how this works it will clean your stamps it's incredible and it will keep cleaning and keep cleaning and keep cleaning even when it looks dirty it does yeah i, I actually feel like i should grab mine because i know these have just come back into stock and have been sold out for so long yes um the idea this is them this is the only way in my opinion and my opinion is is not the you know the most important one but this is the only way that you should clean a stamp okay and all you do is one side and it is filled with thousands of microfibers so it's like having thousands of microfiber brushes and effectively all you actually do is you spray this with water nothing else and you spray the base with water much trust me to get i really got to start using my empty eye zinc bottles haven't <laughs> i because they no, don't clog and basically you clean your stamp on Just one side the dirt. and you dry it on the other wow and that is the only way I found that you do not damage your stamps. You should not clean stamps. If you're using just black all the time, never clean a stamp. Okay. Clean a stamp when you're changing colours. Okay. And something I'll be doing the next time I'm on, which is Boxing Day. Oh, lovely. Um, it is really important for that. You, it is really different really? what we're doing. Yeah. Now, so John, I'm, really see I'm seeing that right now and it's dirty. Yeah. Can we just pick up another stamp and clean it on as it is now? It doesn't matter, does it, that it looks no, dirty? it doesn't matter. That will, if I just take another, I bet I haven't got another stamp with me in my box. Hang on, I have. So I've, I have this laid out like it's my craft cave at home. I think it's brilliant. I, I have my it. boxes laid out exactly the same as I have them at home. So you can see this one. It's all greeny yeah. colour because I've used greeny ink on it. But again, all I do is, this is a little bit dry, let's just... Just spray with normal, regular water. Spray with water, nothing else, everything else. All these stamp cleaning liquids, unless you're using stays on, they can damage your stamp. They're only for that. But what I can do is just literally clean that, okay? Dry that on there and you see that one's clean as opposed to the dirty other ones. You know, but they it's do all the fine little brushes. It gets into all of that detail. But the most important thing I use it for yep. is, the, is cleaning the back of my stamp so they still stick. Brilliant. See, it's, it's great. Nine ninety nine. that's all it is. They do say that water is the best cleaning um, agent in the world. And it, it really is. is. It really is. Don't well. use baby wipes. No. Nope. First of all, they're really bad for the planet. But secondly, baby wipes, even the pure water ones, have got some chemical on them. Really? They've all got an emollient on them. They've yeah, all got so a moisturiser. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't want to put anything on your stamps. You want to take things off. Yeah. So again, and this, you clean it when it's done. I think that is an incredible gift. It really is. And it's kind of a gift that keeps giving, isn't it? It's only 9 99 Right, your one day special. I've got some news for you. It launched 24 minutes ago. Guess what? 
70% of the stock has gone, 70%. We are super, super busy. If you want to get yours, get on the phone lines. It's 01733 62000. Give us a call. We'll sort out everything for you. If you're going for a flexi payment, it's very, very easy to do on the website. You just click flexi buy. And then it's only £24.93 today. And then we'll take another payment in a month's time. Once that flexi basket is open, anything else that you add, maybe you're going for the stamp cleaning kit, then you can divide the cost of that into to two so that'll only be five pounds today if you're going for that uh, right john what we're gonna have a look at first right i thought i ought to show you how to make a flower okay really simple so this is the uh, literally almost the full instruction i gave sam for him to make his okay so you don't need any more i've got up here a piece of foam so this is a piece of the red the bright red and i'm going to fold it in half now i always say you can cut two or three layers sam was actually cutting four Really? Because he has less patience than even I have. So you've just folded. I folded that in you half. You didn't cut it. You folded yeah. it. Okay. Just fold it in half like that. So this is half a sheet. This is A5. That's it. I put my lid on and I'm just going to run it through my die cutting machine as normal. So that's it. That's all I need to do in the terms of cutting, right? And it's very I'm going to light. take one of the stamens. It's very lightweight as well, isn't it, It's John? extremely lightweight. Yeah. The way that it's actually made is there are different grades of foam. Okay. And they're all cut from the same loaf. And it's loaf. literally a loaf. Yeah. Wow. So it's a big loaf of this stuff. And it's literally sliced off. Really? And we have it cut down to the thinnest you can. And you may find, when you get it, yeah. you'll find one, you might find one sheet is really, really thin. Yeah. And one sheet seems thicker. Yeah. It's because it's how it's sliced on a loaf. Oh, wow. But everyone is set within the tolerance. Yes. And the tolerance is, I think it's got to be something like, is it two mil? If it's over that, it has to be heated to move. If it's two mil or less, it can yeah. be moved and manipulated with your hands hey. and it will keep its shape. That's so brilliant. you see here, look how easily all of those have come out. Two layers straight away. Yep. So now, that's it. That is so easy. What would you do with the foam that you've got left over? You could make a stencil maybe. You could actually. Mm. I mean, you could actually start to actually manipulate that. Yeah. And pull that into centres and make little flowers and don't, you know, don't waste it. But... The way I've done the flower plates is to make sure you can get them as close as you can. Okay. If these were individual dies, they would have to have, again, almost a seven miller gap around them. Yeah, of course. So you wouldn't get them in as much. So all I'm going to do now is colour them. Really simple. And I'm going to use the Mica Magic. Yes. Because I now, find this is the easiest thing. And again... Let's bring the details up for the Mica Magic. Um, now we do have both as a bundle you're saving five pounds and that is the metallics and the bright so i'm going to show you the metallics first Ooh, they're lush. very very nice so those are your metallics i'm going to put that one down and then i'm going to pick the brights up uh there you go and then you've got let me turn that out of the way that out of the way then you've got your brights and then i can pick them both up at the same time there you go so the brights and the metallics, where are you? I'll place them on one on top of each other. There you go. The brights and the metallics, if you want both of those, saving five pounds, 24.98. But they are available individually as well, 14.99 individually. So the best way to get them is by going for that bundle. Now, why do we love these, John? Well, the thing is, these are perfect for the foam. So as you can see here, it's just going straight on the black and it's going over because it's mica. It means that it will reflect the light back. So it will go over red. So you can see there, that's black on the end of the red. If I yeah. wanted to... Now, normally ink won't do that. No. But that's fixed. A little bit will come off as I manipulate it. Yeah. That's fixed. But the Mica Magic is like having all these colours of gilding wax. Yes. Because they'll do everything a gilding wax will. Really? So they'll go on your, they'll go on your Zuri moulds. Yes. They'll go on your paper clay. They'll work on your paper, on your card, on your embossing folders. Wow. They'll work on anything, but it's a fixed powder. It's not waxy, so it never dries. I've still got the original sample I had two years ago, and it's still so it won't dry out or anything. So even if you left it open on your crafting table, I left that open as you're like doing that now, for six months, I left one out for six months, like just like that. And it just won't dry out. No, it can't right. dry out because there's no moisture in it. Now that is fantastic. Because it's a That's cream. That's fantastic. So I'm just applying it with the finger dauber, okay. which is a lot easier. And all I'm doing is, and this is the thing, if you're using a dark colour. You want to use something like black. Most people would think, why would I use black on a flower? Yeah, why would you, John? And the reason is, if I want to make a darker shade, once it's pulled, 
then the black will darken it because black actually doesn't exist. So I was taught now? at art college that black and white don't exist. It's all shades of grey. They're not colours. No, they're all actually... Black is an absence of light. White is light. Ooh. So if you if you go and if you buy a black suit, yes, and I remember this from my times at time at that shop that's not called that's the last not the last but the yes yeah I know. Um, if you buy a black suit, if you look really really closely, you'll see it's very very dark navy or very very dark brown. Really? Yeah, because basically black is a con is is all is all the colours mixed together almost to make it. This is what I was taught at college. Wow. So I mean, this top is navy. Yeah, that top is navy, yeah. I know that. But on screen it will look blue. It will look black sometimes. Oh. But the da darker it is. But the thing is, if so what I'm actually doing is by adding black, yes. I'm darkening it. But the fab thing I love about the Micro Magic is, right, so this is the black door, but yeah? Yep. If I want to put some light on, watch, and put this in. Hang on, that's black going on what? Straight into the white, look. No, no white, no black in my white. There's my white. John, I, d that, it, I don't understand Because it's that. mica... Yes. Of course, the mica reflects the light back, so it goes on opaque. So Mind I is totally blown now. But that's not the intention, but this is why I love these so much. So you had black. On I had black. Now, we do have the daubers available for you. And straight into white. Yeah. That, that's it's incredible. Fabulous. Amazing that stuff. That's why we called it mica magic. It's, well, it is magic. Because it's not a powder, it's not a solid. It's in a wow. cream. It's almost a powder cream binder. Yeah. But literally, it's just... So, you know, I can... So, n n none of them will contaminate? No. Nope. That Not is all. fantastic. So, all I'm going to do is shape this. Yep. Yep, really simple. I'm going to start there. So, for um, what we'll do is we'll do the flower I did in here, yeah? Yes, please. The easiest one going. So, all I do is take this, pull, and you're stretching the fibre like I'm you're stretching a jumper. I'm doing that in with fact, the sheet that I've got I here. I can't stop. Can I put one there? Yes. And you there's a little sanitize your hand, you could grab that one and try. Yep. So I'm just gonna pull that. Pull. Yeah. Oops, I tore the petal. So? Just pull it pull. to pull out. Pull it out like you're pulling a you know when you stretch a jumper to make it fit. Yeah, I'm doing yeah. it. Okay. Then take the end and I'm gonna scribble it up in my finger. There you go. That's it. Scribble it up. Come out. Pull, scribble it up. There's my first set of petals. Twizzle Done. it up. Pull it, hurt it. Oh. Yeah. Okay. So. Pull and twist it. Pull it while you're twisting it. Ooh. Pull it a bit. That's it. And it will fix. There you go. So you're stretching the fibres. And do, do you know something? I actually it, it tore there, but it doesn't matter because that looks it looks realistic. It now. looks realistic. If you on what I think it's the rose one. I can't remember, but on the package there, you'll see there's a flower that's actually been torn. Yeah. So all I do again, pull it out. Yep. Pull it out. Each one is different. Pull it out, yeah. Pull it in my fingers and twist it. You know like one of those twist ties you used to use on bread? Yes. It's like that. You're yeah. twisting it, okay? So then I've got two petals done. You see how the black just darkens it, that little bit of white light, yeah. it gives it a sparkle. Give it a sparkle, so you gives take it that shading. One of your stamens. Yep. And your stamens have all got a calyx on them, which is this bit which is the bit that cups underneath the petals. Okay. So you slide that off, and we wanted that on them all. So I'm going to take one, and because they're wired, I don't need to create a hole. It just literally pushes through, push it up, like that. Wow. Yeah, I mean, that's already now starting to look like a Christmassy flower to me. So I'm going to secure it with a little bit of hot glue, but if you don't want to use hot glue, you can use the glue glaze that we do so you can use the craft artist glue glaze yep yeah or you can use but silicon glue will take a long time to dry okay so the glue glaze is quicker growing and all i do is literally squeeze so you wouldn't use hot glue would you John? i'm using hot glue well you can use hot glue yeah i'm using hot glue but i know some people don't like to wow. so what i do then is push the next one through pile it on yep move it around till they're in the right place a little bit more hot glue and I just squeeze those petals on. Let's move those, there we go. Take it down like that. I'm just gonna give that a squeeze there. And there's our flower. Wow. The start of our flower. Doesn't day. that look brilliant? I love it. Now, I've got an update for you on the one day special. We are exceptionally busy. 
Oh no, we're approaching limited stock on your one day special. That's the configuration that you see in front of you right now, your one day special, we're approaching limited stock. Two payments of £24.93. Uh, we've got a whole array of different colours in the foam, beautiful colours as well. You get 60 sheets in total. Uh, you get 96 stamens and you get three die sets. Now, colour-wise, you've got your spring, so you've got those lovely pastel colours. You've got your winter colours, so a little bit darker and richer. You've got your autumn colours um, and you've got two different colours Christmas sets because you've got your reds and your greens in there and you've also got a pink and purple set as well limited stock oh my word John busy 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 yeah um, yeah sorry <laughs> busy busy it's, it's a great deal and it's a great package to put together and as John said straight out of the box you will be creating you'll be crafting away and you'll be making some beautiful flowers that will stay in your home that will stay as a garnish not to eat uh, but actually around the base of a cake would look beautiful they would and if you want to, if you use the mica magic to color your flowers or an ink if you want to put them on the cake you spray them with cheap hairspray you want the cheap sort of 99p plus a penny shop stuff yes not this expensive lacquer yes but you know the really the really cheap stuff yep. spray it with those and that will just seal it and you can then put them around the bottom ah. around the bottom of the that cake or something that is actually a tv trick as well for when you have like fruit on shows and ah. stuff yeah spray it with cheap hairspray so it just stays as it is so all the continuity lasts I didn't know that. Yes, a little but bit of a trick there. Really? Uh, that's why they tell you never eat anything that's on a set because <laughs> you don't know how long it's been there or what's been sprayed on it, so to speak. Uh, 49 85 is your price, saving £31. That's why we're so super, super busy. 370582. Right, so let's give you a reminder of all the other items we've got on the show for you. Let me put those Micro Magics there. We'll come back to those. Now, the flower bundles that we've got available for you. Uh, we've been busy for these. You like these. It doesn't surprise me. These are beautiful. Uh, I want to show you a hydrangea because we were talking about these earlier on and I found this uh, within the samples. Isn't that absolutely spectacular? Ima now, imagine making several of these and placing them together and making a, a, a faux complete hydrangea how lovely is that and with your hydrangeas of course you've got your blues and your pinks depending on the acidity of the soil and sometimes you don't know what you're getting when you plant them uh, but it's not just the hydrangea of course it's not but I wanted to show you that because it looked absolutely beautiful you've got your camellia and your orchids too so let me show you some of the samples that we've got this is a beautiful orchid and we all know how expensive orchids can be it's a very luxurious flower to have and can be quite difficult to look after uh, if you don't know what you're doing. So why don't you make faux ones that are going to last? Now, those are some white orchids. You've got these beautiful, beautiful orchids on here, but also mixed in with some of the hydrangeas and the camellias, which are on there as well. Uh, the camellias are a beautiful flower, and you've got lots of different colours that you can have with those. It doesn't have to be blues and pinks or, or creams. You could multicolour if you want to as well. But they look absolutely divine, don't they? They just add that extra dimension whether it's to a card whether it's to a box for example this is lovely and don't forget we've got those great heart boxes on the show as well so maybe uh, as a decorative item on the boxes they're going to look absolutely fabulous 460134 is your item number and that gets you all three and you can divide the cost into two now let's talk about hearts and let's talk about boxes because the two go very well together. Now this is a great system because you have the dies to build and create your heart boxes and I'll show you the dies. And you've also got the top part. So you've got these beautiful decorative dies that you can make the lids out of. But you can also use the dies to make cards out of as well. So you've got a whole selection of love hearts and with those hearts you can place them onto cards or you can start to build and create lids to the boxes. Now around the edge of the box that's this particular die just here or you've got the decorative dies that one being the butterfly um, love this one it's absolutely gorgeous let me just bring this sample up to show you what we mean so that's the lid of the box that you can see just there um, you might want to turn that into a card let me show you what it looks like when it's a card how amazing is that 
So you've got lots of variety of designs to build and create because they all match as well. And if you just want to use the outer part of the box and to show you which, uh, what I mean by that, just going around the edge of the box is that particular die and that one there. You could extend that, you can make any shape box as long as you change the lid of the box. You might have another nesting die to make. Uh, so that is a great investment at £34.97, and pence, saving £17 on that deal. 586741. Well, you can always make a pincushion, actually. I didn't show you that. That's cool, isn't it? That is brilliant. What a great idea, John. Yeah, that's all that is, is basically cutting the top heart three times. Yeah. And then you put some wadding on it. Um, um, this is mine at home. This is one I actually physically use. So this is mine at home that yep. sits on my desk with all my steel pins in it. That's brilliant. What a great idea. And then in there I've got my needles and some, oh, some ribbon. But this super. is literally, this is why it's mucky. It's on my desk. But all I do is add some wadding onto it, pull the fabric round, glue it down, and then just dress it with some ribbon to hide where it's joined. That is fantastic. What a great idea. Personally, I'll put some sweets and chocolates inside <laughs> there. Uh, right, we've got some Honesty flowers. Honestly, we have. Uh, now, this is a huge collection for you. I'm going to show you the dies um, because it's a lot better to see the dies um, than the packaging that's on there because it gives you a better idea of what you are getting. So you've got your three sets of dies. Again, you can use these to dress up your flowers that you're making. So you've got some gorgeous flourishes there. You've got the beautiful petals that you can start building and creating your fantasy star style flowers and you've also got the leaf flourishes there as well let's show you some samples with those flowers that you can make here we go uh, let's get this the right way around there you go uh, so you've got the lovely flowers there delicate as they're cut out and then you've got that lovely flourish at the top uh, if you want to start building and creating your own fantasy flowers, you've got the opportunity to do so. Isn't that beautiful? Absolutely gorgeous. And what's nice about these as well is when you've cut them out, you can also bring them forward so you can actually double the layers of the flowers but also make them 3D as well so they actually stick out from the card. £26.97, 998408 is your item number. I've got some news for you. The one day special, am I gonna am I gonna give that news? Have we sold out? We have Oops. had a technical sellout on your one day special, 41 minutes into the first live hour. Okay, now we anticipated a sellout. We did, we did. We knew we were gonna be busy when we saw what John had to offer. So we've got a Wild Stocks last bundle. It's the same bundle with the stamens and the dies but all you all, all that's changed is the christmas foam is now gone but you do have two sets of the lighter christmas foam set to be fair i don't think you'll notice the difference so ready steady go for your one day special while stocks last deal here it is it is fabulous if you have just joined us Welcome to Ho-Chandra. If this is the first time that you're viewing us here on Ho-Chandra, it's great to have your company. A one-day special, this is a Wild Stocks last one-day special, is a deal that we have for 24 hours. The first one-day special sold out. Your Wild Stocks last is Wild Stocks last. The one-day special stocks didn't last. That's how busy we were. Um, so you've got your beautiful foam sheets. You're getting 60 sheets in total, a whole array of colours, springtime colours, summer colours, autumn colours, winter colours, Christmas colours as well. You can divide the cost of this into two payments. You've got your dies to cut out the flowers and you've got those marvellous stamens as well. Saving £31. It's the same price, you're making the same saving and you can divide the cost into two as well. So £24.93 today will get the whole of this sent out to you. It is an out of the box experience which means when you get this home and you take everything out of the box, your foam, your dies and your stamens, you're good to go and you can start creating some amazing flowers that will look beautiful on your cards that will give you that extra dimension, maybe for some gifts that you're making and creating. But also, if you want to make some faux flowers to perhaps go in a little jar or a vase, then you can make them too. And they can look so realistic. And these flowers, they don't need watering and they're gonna last for a long time as well. Maybe a little garland you can put together, maybe a brooch, or maybe some decorative 
um, applications to a hat or something like that. £49.85, it's a great deal, but it gets better because we'll divide the cost into two, and that means it's interest-free payments over two months of £24.93. Let's head back to John. Some more demonstrations. What are we going to have a look right, at now, John? Right, so while you were talking, I finished off. So these are the flowers that I made during, in the demonstration. So that is half a sheet of the foam. Oh, half a sheet. So that wow. is every, that I didn't have any pre-cut, as you know, I cut it in. That is half a sheet of the foam. That's it. Makes me all of those. Okay. Yeah. So what I'm going to do is I want to show you a different way to do it, but also I thought I would show you what I think works so well with this, which is why I put had it put in the bundle, is the elderflower. But can you see here how it looks like gypsophilia? Isn't that lovely? So this is actually using the Crafts 2 snow. Is that, ba is that baby's breath? Yes. There you go. But you can see it works really, really well. Do you know what I'm thinking as well? So I wanted to show you how we make that. Yes, please. What I'm thinking as well, poppies. Yes. Poppies are very popular. Poppies work beautifully yes. in this. They really do. And you do get red, of course, uh, with the foam. But not all poppies are red. Some are blue, some are pink. You get the Himalayan poppies, which yes. are a beautiful blue shade. I've even, I think I've even seen some black poppies as well. You yes. Know. Absolutely beautiful. And of course, if with the black, if you got the black foam, which was in the first bundle, but yes. not in the Wild Stocks last. Yes. So that's what's missing. So if you do get the black, I just need to get my tool. What you can do, the Mica Magic, of course, will allow you to colour the black. So you could do the black and then put red Mica Magic in the centre to get that really Ooh. intense colour that you get with like a black blue black poppy. Absolutely, that'd make a gorgeous brush. So all I'm going to do is cut some of the elderflower. Okay. And I designed these to be the perfect sort of filler. But also, as you say, I wanted to get that gypsophilia, that baby's breath look. So I'm just going to run that through. And while I run that through... I find it a very odd name, Baby's Breath. I, it's a strange one, it's, isn't I, it? I think it, because it's so delicate, and a baby's breath is so delicate... It's probably based think, around the same idea. I think. So what I'm going to do while that's going through, I'm just going to set up now. This is a piece of the peach, which again is in the set. Yeah. And you get two sheets of each of this. So I'm using half of one piece, so I'm okay. using only a quarter of this particular colour I get in there. So I'm going to run that through while I make my uh, baby's breath. I, I want to keep calling it that now. I've forgotten it was called <laughs> that. <laughs> I can't get over how light this is. Um, this is a, a, a big wad. Uh, I think this could be 60 sheets right That's here. That's all 60 sheets. Um, it's so lightweight. It really, really is. It's delicate, but it's beautiful to work with as well. And you've got some great and colours the in there. The width of that one as well Oh, you're not you getting were... the black. Well, I'm just, yeah. no. You're not getting the black in this one. But Thanks, the Ben. The width that you're doing in is the same as you get in the expensive ones that card you like a pound a sheet. Yes. Sorry, I was in. I was in. I just. I was just blowing a kiss there to uh, <laughs> to Ben, the floor manager. Did you get caught? Yeah, I did. Sorry, I wasn't told I was in vision. I just went. But it's not. It was also a kiss for you guys at home. But it was a little kiss for our lovely Ben. I don't mean that in any kind of sexist way or whatever. And just you know, I love Ben. <laughs> So, what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to pop these out. So, I'll just do two for speed because I think this is a nice little technique. And I'm going to use my fine tip glue bottle. Ah, now, these are on the website. Do we have these on the website we now? Do, Why yeah. do we, we like these, John? We launched these. We, we came out with these um, yeah. in September. Um, and all I'm going to do is just put a little dribble of glue, I've overwatered mine, on the edge of each one, but you see how literally, before this, before this bottle, I couldn't do this. No. Because the glue tip. would plob everywhere. So, we're just going to Now, just on. while you're doing that, I've got yep. some news. The original One Day Special uh, bounced back. That included that black foam. If you want to go for that, if you're very quick, you'll be able to pop that into your basket. We'll put the details at the bottom of the screen. It's, it is literally the fastest fingers first. It really is. There you go. 370582. That is for the original one day special, but we've got the wall stops last here right now. Right, so this is the Crafts 2 Snow, the one millimetre snow that we did. Oh, but of course, it's it not that. just snow for Christmas. So if I leave that to dry, yep. they will go clear and matte because okay. that's how the glue is designed. But straight into the snow 
And there's baby's breath. Oh, that is good. That is gorgeous. What a great idea. So again, so easy to do. Doesn't help if I put the pot over the top, <laughs> but just like that. But that's exactly, to me, that's exactly how it looks. Yeah. So it's definitely worth going for those um, applicators, the glue applicators. I would, yeah, I wouldn't if be you, without you mine. I yeah. absolutely love it. Um, find them on the website and then you can pop those into your basket as well. So I've got here the peach. I wanted to show you another way to shape exactly yes, the please. same flower. So this is exactly the same as the red ones I did. But this time I'm just going to colour, I'll just colour a couple of them. I'm using my water media mat because this is heat, so I can do everything on yes. it. I don't have to worry about changing anything. Do we so have those time, on the website? I, th I think so. Mm. I, I hope so because uh, it, it's my product of the year. Yeah. I absolutely adore and what it. Are we, what, what, what are we calling it? The it's the watercolour medium mat. That's it, the watercolour medium mat. Yes, we do have it on the show. It's what John's using at the moment. Uh, we'll bring the details at the screen. Why do you love it so much? It's only 19 99 Well, the thing is now I'm using Mica Magic on this, which yes. is permanent on everything. Okay. Yeah, but it's not permanent on this because it's silicon. But here's my heat gun, and my heat gun, look, is set on here. And my heat gun, I can let it pour out heat glue, hot glue onto here, and it won't damage it. Wow. And cold glue, nothing damages it. It goes to the dishwasher. It doesn't. Yeah. Does it? Because it's silicon. It, was, it came from an original idea of a soldering mark. I, I found this out later. Yes. Um, but that's the idea, and we designed it to have the trays and how we wanted it. But I do all my colouring and shading on it, but, of course, that just washes off. Excellent. Whereas the Micro Magic sits for everything else. I used to put paper underneath. Do you know what? That would be a great uh, addition, if you've, even if you've got a glass mat at home, for example, to have something that's going to protect your surfaces. Um, it'll be superb. If you do want to get hold of that watercolour media mat, 19.99. We're always really busy when we have this on. 785543 is your item number. And go and check out the other accessories we've got for you as well. So I've got to be quick on this. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to stretch, yeah, around each petal, pulling apart. Remember how I did originally? Yeah. With the um, foam just to show you. So pull around each petal, but look at that now. It's like a sweet pea. And I'm just yeah. going to pull it out, yeah? So the same again, pull it round each one. And all I'm doing is grabbing between my finger and my thumb. Yep. And then pulling, you see how the red, it's not come off. The Micro Magic, Lovely. but how it blends in, yeah, and it looks right as a flower colouring, yeah, it because does. it's subtle but it's opaque, and yeah. that's what we need. Oh, so they I go around like that to flute it and then pull out. So Do I've got. Do you think you need much practice, John? No. Well, Sam made this with this technique instantly, Aww. genuinely instantly, and I know that he's getting into his crafting, but as I say, he will not take direction from me. Um, he does it his way, um, and he said, I'll do some for you. So he cut them out. He said, right, how do I shape them? So I did this, literally. I showed him this one and said, this is what you do. You go around each edge, and he'd already, because, you know, I, my eyes are always bigger than my belly, as they say, <laughs> and he's the same. So he'd already cut out, like, a whole sheet yes. to do this. So he did it. He went, oh, that's easy got the wreath, covered it in ribbon, and just started literally pinning wow. these in. Well, you know what, Sam? We'll have to get you guesting here on Hochanda. Yeah, he said he'd never do that. <laughs> he, he's uncontrollable, bless him. <laughs> I know, but it'd be so a lot again, of fun. So again, same thing. I'm using a red stamen this time. Yes. Taking the kylix off, pushing yep. through the middle. Yep. Yep. Okay, but there already, look at that. That is gorgeous, John. Take another one. Okay. Rotate it round. Push that one on. How lovely. Take and your calyx. And if you're making any it. wreaths as well for Christmas. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm just going to put a little bit of hot glue here. Yep. Yeah. Just there. And I'm just going to put that on, slide it to the end and seal it. And it's the calyx that finishes it because it gives it that right finishing touch. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Holds it in place. But that then is the different flower. But that's made the same dye as that one. 
Isn't that incredible? And the same foam, just a different colour, but you get a different flower entirely. Now think about how much that would be when you go to the shops, you see those faux flowers, I'm sure you've seen them, I'm sure you've all been up to them and gone, oh, I'll have that one and I'll have this one and I'll have that one and oh, that will look nice on the table and that will look nice, a little garland. And then you see the price of what it all comes to <laughs> and you start to put them back. I Probably went... not where they came from because it's just no, too expensive. I went to a shop, picked up some faux flowers, yep. thought that they, I read the price wrong, thought they were 3 95 I went to the till to pay and the picked ones I'd picked up, it was £200. No, John. They were 13 95 Yes, well, there you go. That's what we're talking about. But here, right now, you can start to make your own flowers, some fantasy flowers if you want to when you get the hang of it. But it is an out-of-the-box experience because everything is there for you it is a while stocks last now with you one day special don't delay there's another live hour coming back at eight o'clock but i've got to tell you now that over 10 percent has gone of the while stocks last for your phone for your dies and the stamens john it's been an absolute pleasure it's been brilliant thank I'd you i'd love to give you a big hug but i can't no uh hopefully we'll be able to do that soon but we'll see you at eight o'clock you're on with Catherine. brilliant have a rest in between and you guys stay where you are i can't even speak